Hi, I'm Val from Barbella Fitness and this was a pretty decent chest day workout because I made a little bit of some gains during this workout. My one rep max for my flat bench is 135 and I only did that once last summer. And along with that I did 120 pounds just before that and I've only I've only done that once also in the summer. So uh, I've been doing a lot of 5x5s and 5x3s for 150 pounds like you see here. But I was afraid to go heavier but I decided, oh, you know, let me try 120 pounds. Never really attempted 120 pounds uh, except for that one rep that I did last summer. And on my first set here I did 3 reps which is uh, a rep PR for me. And then, you know, I decided why don't I uh, try 5x3s with this weight? So, on my second set, I uh, got that third rep in there. It was a little bit of a struggle, but by my third set, it was getting a little bit worse. Because I was having a hard time with my form, so because I didn't want to fail with the bar on my chest. So I had my butt all the way up from the bench. And so when I went on to my, uh, my fourth set, I only had two reps at this point. And I was done. But I have a thing with number five, so I needed to finish off with my fifth set here for 120 pounds for one rep. That was my chest day. I mean, it was still pretty good even though I kind of failed at the end with my 5x3s. But as my finisher, I always kind of punish myself a little bit. Did an AMRAP of 95 pounds for 10 reps, which might be a rep PR for me because I think the most I've done before was 8 reps. My goal is to, you know, bring my rep up more, maybe get 12 next time and eventually 15 and then 20. And I always do dips, so I went on to the dips, I did five sets of this. Some days are good, some days are bad, and uh, I think it was one of those days where I wasn't really feeling it for dips, kind of struggling with the dips on that day. Like I alternate with my my strength each week and went on to the inclines here I did a 5x5 five five for 75 pounds on the incline bench one of my favorite chest workouts is the mid chest flies so I always try to do some kind of fly work either the mid chest the, or the low flies hitting your upper chest. I hardly, if ever, I hardly do declines or um, any high bar working on my lower part of my pecs. And then went on to the one arm tricep extension underhand, alternating that. Sometimes, uh, each week, I alternate my tricep workout. That's why I keep a log too on my workout logs, what I've done. And then I ended up, ended my workout with the rope crunches here. I did five sets for 20 reps each. And that was my workout for my chest day. Okay, so I'm back home and I had a good uh, workout, good chest and triceps. But first of all, I want to wish everyone a happy new year, a happy 2016. I hope all your dreams and wishes come true. My resolution for this year is to continue what I started four years ago, and that's training and working hard and uh, continue to stay fit. And I've been consistent with my workouts for the past four years, but most of my videos are, are just lifting and hopefully motivating people to, to lift and to be consistent. If I post videos out, uh, my weekly videos, 
um, I hope it helps you guys and I hope it, it motivates you um, you're never too old to start I started when I was 42 and uh, I'm 45 now I'll be turning 46 this year so I'm fucking old man I'll post the next video out soon and I uh, just want to thank you guys for watching and see you guys again next time